thing at least. Welcome back again to the channel again. Uh, today we've got Grant. Morning. Right, today on Grant's car, uh, we're going to be doing a few things. We're going to be doing the actuator on it, as you can see, and we'll be doing the uh, reset valve on it as well. And we're putting a exhaust system cap back from turbo all the way back to the back of the car. Uh, but first off, basically what we're going to do is if I give you a little rundown of the engine to show you little bits and bobs how dirty it is we are going to give it a quick little steam clean of all like all the crap out of here all the bits down the side probably can't see it too well but yeah just get rid of all the little bits of gritty and dirt clean all that up behind there steam clean all that and just make it all look nice and fresh for him um, and plus we'll be doing all inside the bonnet doing all around here and that so yeah right let's get it guys hope you'll enjoy Done all the steam cleaning now. Just give it a little show of basically everything, how clean it is. But yeah, you can get an idea really of how clean it is now. Even down there, inside the shut. Even inside there, all cleaned up. So yeah, you can see how good that little uh, sting clean has done it all. How clean it is. Right, that's it for the sting cleaning now, people. Right, what we're going to do now is crack on with doing the, um, the exhaust and the um, actuator. actuator. Cheers, Grant. <laughs> I need him here. Actuator and the um, recirculation valve. Cheers, Grant. I'm just going to give the channel over to Grant. He's going to run it for me. Sorry, my mind just goes a bit blank sometimes. Can't get the words out. But yeah, basically that's what we're going to crack on with. And uh, yeah, hope you all enjoy it. See you all soon, guys. show you where we are at the moment but as you can see there we've got the research valve off so there's the old research valve the standard one obviously it weren't making a noise so we know it ain't damaged or anything so it's in pretty good condition really um, Grant's got the new one turbo smart so yeah we're gonna get that on in and replace it see these two bits here obviously the other side all blank so basically with these two bits there it's got to sit sort of like that in the housing yeah so basically this one on these sides yeah let's get focus this one here will go into 
if we focus in into that bolt hole here if I can get it properly yeah into that one there We're on the preload stage now. This is uh, basically what you've got to do. Now, you see this nut here at the bottom. Basically, the flap, it will open and close like that, basically, with this rod going in and out under pressure of the actuator. Now, what you do is keep this shut to the, where it closes uh, the penny valve take this bolt up to rest onto it a, like a little bit and then you do full uh, two full rotations of the nut um, you probably won't see it too well but on the actual nut I have marked it to show whereabouts it is um, so we're just gonna do two full rotations and that will be it adjusted and then you bring this nut down and lock it off and that's your preload sorted out right that's it guys uh, everything on the front end of the car all the reset valve and the actuator all done now so now we're just moving on to the three inch pipe um, from Piper um, yeah so basically what we're going to be doing is uh, swapping it out for this two and a half inch exhaust system which we got just follow it all the way through as you can see so yeah we've undone a few little things with the uh v-band already we got all that off already so yeah we're just gonna crack on and get everything all swapped out uh just a quick one as well just like to say a big thank you to ian duck as well on facebook um, everything he supplied to us, everything we've needed, he's had, and that he's just an absolute genuine guy. Uh, go and look him up. Um, he, he's got loads of bits and bobs for people and that, whatever you need. But yeah, so a big thank you to Ian Duck. Really appreciate everything, mate. Been a great help, um, and he's trusted us with a lot of things like before. Uh, we've got to swap over the exhaust and hand back the other one because he's doing a part X for it But yeah, big up uh, Ian Duck. Thank you very much mate. Really appreciate your uh, Your help out basically you've really supported the channel uh, Really grateful uh, Grant's really grateful as well So yeah, we're just gonna crack on get all the bits on and yeah catch you all in a minute Right, the exhaust is all done now, guys. Uh, Grant's just getting in, trying just to, uh, well, trying to get in. Come on, <laughs> get the old shoe on on him. Uh, hold on a sec, Grant, just have a look at all, how nicely clean that engine bay is. 
and yeah now we're going to go to the back coming down the street at night would you it's got a fire no we haven't really it's just the steam coming off yeah let us know how well done uh grant did for holding the camera and that and being my cameraman for the day no. and thank you vin no it's no usual. problem no problem right let us know what you think guys what do you think of the standing exhaust against the uh cobra um it was cut no it's called piper. piper sorry guys piper exhaust so yeah let us know your thoughts and yeah catch you on the next one guys see you all soon <laughs>